Okay, YouTube family, let's talk about it. It's your favorite girl. Okay, guys, so I want to do a reaction to y'all favorite girl. Definitely not my girl, Big Red Lewis. So I see a lot of you guys in the comments are feeling some type of way about what I have been saying about Big Red Lewis. Now, what you guys have to understand, unless you guys are incompetent, that whatever I repeat is what I see. I don't make shit up. <laughs> That's what I don't do. So whatever she's putting out there in the universe for people to see, I'm going to talk about it. All right. If you don't want nobody talking about you, stop doing stupid shit. And if I feel that is stupid that is my opinion whatever she's doing she may feel that it's not stupid then that's her this is my opinion and y'all already know when i talk about big red or square head or bruce jen or anybody it's called messy news messy news is being messy so when you're being messy you're not being nice all right and you're giving your opinion all right so now let's get to the video so Big Red uploaded a live about four days ago that did not show her in a good light. But if you think about it, all of the content that this lady has been putting out, none of it shows her in a good light, okay? She doesn't care that she looks ignorant in the YouTube streets or in Instagram streets. She doesn't care that she has a minor daughter that looks up to her and that can see her shaking her bowling ball ass on Instagram. She don't care. I would never give my daughters my Instagram and let them follow me and watch me shake my goddamn ass on Instagram. I will never do no goddamn such thing. Do I shake my ass? I, yes, I do. But do they know my Instagram name? Hell no. If I'm in the public eye and people is watching me, I'm not going to do certain things because I don't want to be judged. The fact that she do what she do, she don't give a damn. That's what y'all have to understand. This lady does not care about what y'all see. Do she care about what you say? Yes, she does. It hurts her feelings. That's why she deleted the live. She saw all of these people doing reactions to her live and she realized how stupid she looked. You know... Big Red is kind of slow, so she needs help understanding her wrongs. You know, it's like a kid. It's like a a, a, a a kid that needs help figuring out what they're doing wrong or give them an example to help them understand because apparently, you know, her comprehension skills is just not there. And she want us to believe she's going to school to be a nurse. Do y'all really think Big Red Lewis is going to comprehend her? <laughs> Listen, my ex dude went to school for nursing okay and it's a lot of reading can y'all picture big red lewis reading all the time <laughs> can y'all she don't even have time to sit down and help her goddamn daughter with her school work so how the hell she's gonna go back to school come on now she's like she say a bunch of shit just because it's like it's like racing thoughts it's almost like bipolar now i'm not saying she's bipolar this may be a cry for help because she said before she had to take a break from social media to get her thoughts together. You know, I feel like she's traumatized from the whole situation that happened with Squarehead. I don't think no woman plans to be a single parent. And she just can't get over this man made her mother and disappear. She cannot get over it. But instead of her frustration and all of her anger going towards the woman he loved, that shit need to go towards his ass. And no matter what he do in the internet streets, no matter how dumb he will make her look, if this man says he wants to be with her, she, she'll be with him. After all the disrespect, after all of that, she will still be with this man. And it's sad. And it goes back to being low, having low self-esteem and not knowing your worth. Clearly, she don't know her worth. And it's just sad. She need to go get her some help. All right? And if y'all gonna be supportive of her, support her. Don't worry about what the fuck I'm saying over here. Because I'm gonna say what I want to say. I don't care if you like it or not. Understand. This is messy news and I'm gonna be messy. I already told y'all. When she mentioned me and put my picture in her goddamn video, it's up. It's forever. So I'm watching. And I'm gonna have something to say. All right. All right. Now let's talk about Square Head and Bruce Jenner. 
So Square had uploaded a new video titled How My Father's Day Went. Now I did not watch it. I already told you. But I did caught a couple of clips of the video from someone else's channel. And Squarehead is getting a baby daddy body. Squarehead, what's going on? What happened to that muscular body you used to possess? Because I'm starting to see a beer belly. Squarehead, do you drink beer? Because you is just, oh, Squarehead, I know damn well you're not letting yourself go. Your ass getting big. You got Bruce Jenner over there with her man legs and man arms and man face. And she in the gym getting even more muscular. And you letting yourself go? Y'all drop down in the comments if y'all peep Squarehead little two-piece outfit he had on with his damn big belly. Drop down in the comments. Do Squarehead have a big belly? And do y'all think Squarehead is really happy? with bruce jenner do y'all think that because she's been around for a while and you know what he 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 be throwing shade at her i don't care now if you look at her pictures that she put on instagram stories with all the filters and then how she be looking in his videos oh it's shit bitch i don't see how he do it. i just don't see how he do it because i know he's not with her for the looks He's definitely not with her for the looks. The simple fact that Squarehead, and I have said this shit so many times, but I'm going to say it again, that he chose to be with Bruce Jenner over his first baby mama is just sad. Royalty left and let them two fight over him. And instead of him going to his baby mama who he knows is in love with him he go get Bruce Jenner drop down in the comments what y'all think that's about why did Squarehead choose Bruce Jenner when he had the opportunity to choose Big Red Lewis he had the chance to finally get her back because according to her they was in love that was she said and she said they was in love they was together <laughs> This is sad. It's sad and embarrassing as hell. And I know she hurt. That's why she lashing out. Her lashing out, her being angry, you know, all of that is because she's hurt. She is hurt that CJ don't want her. And I know it hurts to watch your baby daddy, the man that you in love with, Big Red Lewis be on camera with another woman because remember you said it was your time to shine and we thought after Rudd's he gave him to y'all that he was going to choose you and it was going to be your time to shine but he rather shine with an alleged woman that looks like Bruce Jenner and not to mention to watch royalty kids and your daughter is back in Gary with you and he's there being a father to royalty kids at that age when he was not there for yours. Girl, this shit she doing, she is hurt. I don't know if she's going to ever recover from this, but she's hurt. But baby girl, be mad with your baby daddy. Be mad with him because he's responsible for you feeling this way. Although she's in control of her own, she uh, honestly, she's in control of her feelings. She's in control. She chooses to feel this way. But it's because of him, not because of royalty. But anywho, royalty don't move on with her life. Royalty is happy. And she's not thinking about y'all. <laughs> but anywho, guys, that's all I got. I was nice today. Hmm. Until 